Hello everyone and welcome to Action RPG. I'm your host Aaron, and for today's video we're headed to the world of Last Epoch. The good old developers from 11th Hour Games have officially bestowed upon us the new Mage and Acolyte character models. We also get to see the reworked Sentinel model in its completed form and three new sets coming to the characters for 084. Lots of good information on this video. Now before we begin, I've been saying at the beginning of all my videos, it is the season of giving, and I am hoping that today is the day I have earned your subscription. I'm hoping that today is the day you make the decision to push that little red button. If you love Last Epoch, if you support me, if you like the channel, I'm hoping I've earned it. All right, let's jump right into this. Right now we are on the official Last Epoch website under general news, new character models. Now I'm not gonna read through all this. It basically says that they're working on the silhouettes and the lighting and the faces and they want it to look as good as possible. Yes, 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 we get it. Starting off with the mage. Now they don't want it to get too far away from what we had. They're just tweaking it. And you can kind of see that in the facial features. He's floating, his book is floating, and he still looks kind of scary looking. But obviously, much better than what we previously had. As we move down, look at this. It's a big difference. Look at those eyes. He needs to eat a little bit right there. So that's the mage. Oh, one more. Him spinning. Look at this. He's got his little potions in the back. I don't know if I've seen those. Let me see those potions one more time. Look like mana. Mana and health, maybe. All right. So that is the mage moving over to the acolyte. Dude, she is scary. I mean, come on. Those are very intense eyes. I mean, she looks possessed with her arm all. <sighs> You can see the detail. Look at that. Check this out. She looks like a witch. They did a good job. She is very scary looking. She kind of looks the same. Kind of looks the same. And there is your acolyte. Sentinel correction. Now, we caught that the Sentinel didn't look right when they dropped the new model already, and I've already covered that, so they made a correction. The left is what they showed us previously. Basically, he's like, I don't know, he's heavier on the left side. Now, on the right side, he has thinned out a lot, and you could really tell that in the legs, right? No more tree trunks. The lean, mean fighting machine. So that is the new Sentinel model. Okay, but we are not done. What else are we working on beyond 8.4? Our work on the characters does not end with these changes. The rogue model will also get some improvements, but we know that many of you waiting for more variations of characters look when using different armor sets. Yes, we are. So let's take a look at the new armor sets that are also coming. Check this out. Acolyte. And I know it is really hard to see the in-game render. It's a very little picture, but obviously it looks a lot better. This is the zoomed out actual art for it. Got the little horns coming off, very spiky. Arms missing. Looks good. Looks good. Acolyte set. As we scroll down, my favorite. This is a new mage set. And on here it says tier four. Tier four. When I see this set, I know everybody's going to see something different. My mind immediately goes to Protoss in Starcraft. I make that reference all the time. That's when I see like what, like a Zealot or I don't know, something like that. Basically, anytime I see any form of gold armor, I think of Protoss. But this one is my favorite of everything that they dropped today. The Mage Tier four armor. Very clean looking. Very clean. Last but not least, and looking through all the comments, this is most people's favorite. This is the new Tier 4 Rogue set. Obviously, Marksman, Robin Hood looking. See that? The Rogue. 
And in game, it looks really good. As far as little pictures go, this one probably looks the best. The hat with the feather. Very, very nice touch. So that is what we got today. Three new armor sets. Acolyte, Mage, Rogue, and three new character models. Sentinel. Acolyte. Very scary looking. Acolyte to me, I mean, obviously it is a huge improvement, but looks like they really kept her looking the same. And then your new mage. That's the news. And I'm pretty sure we're going to have some other news coming tomorrow. We're hoping it's either dungeons or legendaries, but stay tuned. I want to know your opinion. Okay, very simple question. Mage, Acolyte, or Sentinel? Between those three, which one is your favorite based upon the new models coming to 084? Let me know in the comment section below. I'm sure you've heard by now that I have officially started a Twitch streaming on Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday, having so much fun with the ARPG community, made 15 build guides for 083, planning 20 for 084. All of them are linked in the description, and the first link in the description is for my Twitch if you want to go there and support. If you haven't had a chance to join the official Action RPG Discord, please do so. We're now over 1,200 members, great conversations every day, especially around last epoch. The idea is to create a gaming community that could jump from game to game together, so you never start the server alone. Link for that Discord is also in the description. I hope you all enjoyed this LE084 update video. Hopefully you're entertained or at least learn something. Aaron, out.